First tonight, a community came together to mourn the loss of Michael White, the 16-year-old Wyoming teen who, according to police, was found beaten to death in a park over the weekend. 24-Hour News 8 Sarah Hurwitz was at that vigil honoring White tonight. and She's live now with how friends are remembering him. Well, Michael White saw the good in people, was inventive, and had a love for skateboarding and hanging out with his friends. For many who spoke tonight here at Prairie Park in Wyoming, it was about recounting the times they'll remember most. You know, he looked up to me, and I, that's one of the last things he told me, and that really, really hits me right here, because now he's been looking down at me, and I'm looking up at him. A circle of friends and family. Michael knew how to say what he wanted to say. Listening and sharing stories about 16-year-old Michael White. Made more than him while riding a skateboard. It didn't end well. Holding on to the light that White shone onto others. I guess he could see more in people than the average person. I'm going to remember his kindness and generosity and how he was always smiling. Family and friends say White was a free spirit who loved goofing around and having a good time with his friends. It was in, I believe, fifth grade and we stayed up all night playing Yu-Gi-Oh cards and Pokemon and, you know, we were nerds. The circle stretched from grade school friends to his best friend Bailey, who saw him the day before White disappeared. He was a fun kid. Uh, he always used to go riding around longboarding with me at like 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. He used to go down the biggest hills. A moment for this group to remember and write a message. He's going. He's going. He's going. Yeah, he's going. Yeah. To the teen who uplifted his friends and family. Ever? and use this as a driving force to do good in your life. Now, no word yet on funeral arrangements, but right now, family are hoping to get more answers into what happened in, in Lions Park that led to Michael White's death. Live in Wyoming, Sarah Hurwitz, 24-Hour News 8. Thank you, Sarah. 24-Hour News 8 was the only camera in court today as the 15-year-old suspect in Michael White's murder made his first appearance. At today's hearing, the court decided that the suspect will be held for five days without bond as the prosecutors determine whether or not to charge him as an adult. Right now, he is still considered a minor, so we're not naming him, but it's not the first time that he's been in trouble with the law. We got our hands on a court file that shows cases dating back to 2013, one for criminal sexual conduct with someone under the age of 13, destroying property, and a runaway case. Police. Still not saying anything about a motive or if others were involved. We will, of course, keep you updated as this case moves forward.